Hey guys, what's going on? It's DJ TLM. You're watching DJ TLM TV, and welcome to my soon to be fully operational new workspace. Now, right now, you're only seeing this empty corner. I'm still finishing up some stuff. Starting next week, I will be recording most of my footage right here, and I'll show you the entire room then. This is my new workspace. I'm very excited about this. I've been waiting for this for a long time. Um, it's Monday. I want to ask you a question, and then I get back to work. So, the question is from Reed. And the question is, the guy who's been mentoring me and teaching about DJing has told me that I eventually need to learn other genres of music and play them. Right now I play hip hop and R&B. But the more I think about it, the more I don't want to. I got into DJing because I love hip hop music and the art of DJing. Any advice? Yes. Very plain and simple, follow your passion. I posted this on Instagram a week ago follow your passion that's what I did that's what allowed me to continue to do this through all the ups and downs for 25 years and yes people will tell you you need to play more styles in order to get more gigs and stuff like that look if you know like you tell me that you don't want to play other styles of music don't this is about you you got into this for a reason and if your passion is hip-hop and R&B follow that and some DJs, people might not agree. Let me know in the comment section down below. That's perfectly fine. But you have to understand for the people who do play everything or don't even care if they like the music they play, that works for you. That doesn't work for everyone. For instance, it doesn't work for me. I can't play music that I don't like. I've been told many times by different DJs, man, you need to just stop with the hip hop on and R&B, start playing this or that, whatever, because that's where the money is at. That's not why I got into DJing. So, of course, I made this my full-time profession. I need to get paid. But if I start to do stuff that goes against my feeling, I won't last much longer. This needs to be fun for me. Of course, it's business. I need to make my money. But this needs to be fun for me. I got into this because I love this. And the passion is what kept me going. So, if I kill that passion, by doing stuff I don't want to do, I might as well just stop DJing and find some other means to make my money and just play my favorite records in my room. So that is my advice to you. Definitely follow your heart, follow your passion um, because that will help you out in the long run. And I'm always proud and excited to tell people that I was able to start making a living of doing the thing that I love to do the most. That is a special feeling. And if I start to do stuff I don't like, different story. This is gonna be different for everyone. That's my only advice about this. And in this case, I am very curious to know what your opinion is when it comes to this subject. So do you feel that a DJ needs to learn to play multiple genres? Or should a DJ just pick the genres he or she likes, become good at that, and let that be their lane. That's how I feel about it. And I came from hip hop. Hip hop is my main love, but I play a lot of styles of music because I like those styles of music. So at certain parties, I will play hip hop, R&B, dancehall. I might play soul and funk. I might play some trap. I might play some uh, moonbaton. I might play some UK garage, some grime. I like a lot of different styles, but there's also styles I definitely don't like and I will not play because they're not for me. So I'm lucky, I like a lot of styles so I can be an open format DJ, but at the end of the day, I still only play what makes me happy. That's it. Let me know in the comment section. This could be interesting. So join the conversation in that comment section down below. Let me know how you feel. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you like it, share the video, and subscribe to this channel if you're new to the channel. I drop a lot of content and you don't want to miss out on any of that. I'm going to get back to work. You'll get the tour soon. Everything's going to be in here. And that's going to allow me to shoot a lot more videos. So I can't wait for that. Uh, thanks for watching. And I will be back soon. 